Good morning guys, welcome back to Shine Unique Vlogs JA and this is my sorrel farm. I posted a video when the sorrel were just germinating and now this is how tall the sorrels are. They even start to put on some baby sorrels. So you know by end of November, early December, I will have sorrel. Over here we have some chicken manure that we used on the sorrel and we got some more bags and uh, I don't think we're going to put any more on it but this is a tour of the farm now we are in November today is what the 4th of November right so this is what the farm currently looks like a sorrel farm we have some pumpkin in here too and we still have a few sweet potato slips because remember this was the area that we had planted up the sweet potato okay so let me give you a a better view of the sorrel yep this is the sorrel beautiful sorrel farm in jamaica saint elizabeth jamaica well, we're on the border of manchester and saint elizabeth and if you notice some of the sorrel have like a little yellowish shade because it's two breeds of sorrel we have the hybrid and the not so hybrid <laughs> so um we planted these sorrels approximately a month ago and look at it i think it's a month and two weeks sorry a month and two weeks yeah a month and two weeks and as you can see as i said they're putting on sorrels already the baby sorrel but you can see the the farm is nice and clean because of course scotty has been here helping me out See, we have some sweet potato slips running there. We're going to use these slips to plant up some other land. Plant up some more sweet potato. Yeah. So we have sorrel running along with, sweet potato running along with the sorrel, sorry. So this is my sorrel farm. In Jamaica we had planted some sorrels down at the bottom here but I don't know what happened to those seeds um, I'm not sure what happened to those oh I can still see one that needs to be oh a couple that needs to debush so I'm gonna call Scotty and I see okra in there that needs debushing there's a lot of work to be done on the farm guys a lot of work so this new this is a new patch of sweet potato that we planted we planted this sweet potato three weeks now yeah three weeks but this side as you can see this this section is kind of stunt because it was I don't know there was just a lot of weed growing at this section but not so much at that section so you see it's more flourishing and the the sweet potatoes are running off more it's because of the fact that this side was planted last this so he started planted from down here and then he went up to the top so down here started to take bush more and he took a couple of weeks to come back so hence you know this is where these sweet potatoes are but because we've been getting constant rain um they are taking off again so this is some sweet potato I'm now going to go down there and show you my yam look at my yam farm so you guys already know that I started my YouTube channel that's my first channel Shanzen Zen Jamaican Vibes I'm doing farming videos because farm is a passion for me I just love farming I love to see the the seeds when they burst in 
and I love to see the results after you plant and you watch it grow and you watch it come and of course you make something back off what you put in the ground right yeah so just seeing the seeds germinating watching it every day until it bursts and you see that little leaf come out it's just a beauty for me and farming is something that i love 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 with all my heart um i don't get to you know be on the farm as often as i would be showing you guys exactly what i do but this is a video to update you on the farm all right so before we go on that side i want to show you some okra we have some okra right here we have some okra coming up i thought these okra had died you know <laughs> but fortunately for me they haven't so i'm gonna go around so i can take you down to where scotty is currently these are cocos cocoa and more cocoa young cocoa leaf coming up I like to see when the leaves are coming out and you would have remembered that I planted this banana tree last year this is how big the banana tree currently is and it has some new banana banana suckers coming up Your yeah, leaves shiny and green. So you know the banana tree well healthy. Some of them died, but this one lived and I'm glad because see it's now so you know it has sucker we can transplant on other side sections of the farm. We are also going to be planting some cane on the farm. So you guys would have remembered the canes that I showed you um, at that point, I think it was, I was about three months old, but it had put out a lot of canes. I had only planted one cane head and it put out 50 canes, 50 canes. And these are the canes that you're looking at right now. All from the one cane head. Okay, so now I'm on the other section of the farm. And this is the yam, yellow yam. Um, so we had started to, to also fence off this section. But the post that we got, some of them rotten out. So we had to take it back down. And we're going to re-fence it because I have all the fencing wires. We're going to re-fence it. But, ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at my beautiful yam farm remember this big tree that we had to cut down yeah so you can see the yams are now wrapping around the tree yam them healthy and shiny so i have a nice size yam farm i think it's 75 or 100 hills but some of the stick them had fallen down so we, we're going to have to get some like this one. So we have to get some more yam sticks. Because if we don't get the yam sticks, the yams will just stay stunned and they won't grow because they won't have anything to run on. Alright. This is the pineapple. The pineapple are a bit shady. Because they were in a lot of bush. But. Because it is now weeded out. And it's getting the sunlight. And I'm going to give it some manure. Some of that chicken manure. It will bring it back forward. Uh, so this is my bird pepper tree. When we're cooking on the farm. This is where we come to get our spice. Or pepper all right all right so that's it for this vlog remember to like subscribe and share